All right, I'm about to fight Mac, and my camera only has uh, enough memory to record nine minutes, so we better get started. Or I can uh, attempt to skip the Mac fight real time. Let's see if I can do this. I haven't really practiced it in a very long time. So let's see. Come on. Ah. Come on, giant pogo stick man. I don't have a terribly high amount of time and I don't know what you're going to be like. In the beta, I guess you'd call it a beta beta version of this, this fight was actually really hard and the people that were subscribed to me many months ago saw me attempt to do this, but then to be honest I just completely quit on it. Alright, we're fully healed. Mallow's probably could have used a few more fights to get level, but let's go. First off, let's get rid of some of these bodyguards. Okay, one of them can randomly attack, I don't mind. I need to get rid of all but one, that way Mac doesn't decide to jump up. As long as you only have one, he will never jump up on you, and he, he will never call more bodyguards. I'm just trying to get rid of all of them as quickly as quickly as I can. And I just failed to block that and I paid the price. Now I have to make a choice. I choose HP rain on Mario. One of them can randomly attack, I don't mind. I'm kind of wishing I didn't sell like Kiro Kiro Cola a while ago. Please be on Mario, thank you. It does exactly half, and you'll have to remember that. What am I doing? Not mushroom, I need a honey syrup. There we go. No messing around, I want to get rid of this one bodyguard. Now that I have, I can live peacefully. I wonder if I'm missing the timing on that. Remember, I cannot hear what I'm playing, so... Rain on Mario. We have about five minutes left. Also, I was getting the timing right. Let's see what the what jump does to this guy. Seventy. And if he attacks again, Kindle will be his counter attack to jump. He didn't, so I can only only assume that it isn't. I'm just going to get this bodyguard down to one hit status, that way when I beat Mac, he won't destroy me with a single few turns. I wonder how lethal Flame Wall is. I'm sure he has it. Let's see, 11, uh, I can last another hit.
Then go use a mushroom on Mario. Make sure he's nice and healthy. I think the bodyguards may have slightly less attack, but I'm not sure. And that's why you keep your Mario healthy. Let's see, seven mushrooms left. I can afford to use a few honey syrups. So I'll use, I'll use HP grade over a mushroom. Next turn I'll probably heal Mallow because he'll probably die to Firewall. Yep, he definitely would. I see that my mystic freebie little ability is starting to come back to me. Now because I'm curious, I'm going to use the honey syrup. That way I can use shocker on Mac next turn. Yep, my freebie abilities are coming back. Happy day. Oh, he still has the charging thing. You see, when he's done charging his lasers, he'll use a static E, which is his most powerful attack. At least that's what he did in the beta. And here's to always keeping our Mario healthy. <coughs> Excuse me. About two minutes left of recording time on my camera. See you, Mallow. We'll just pick you right back up. Because having two turns is better than having one in most all cases. I think I'll be safe using another one. No, I won't. Ouch. I'll heal Mallow. I'll heal Mario. Yeah, it's a really good, good thing that I healed. He'll probably start spamming Flame Wall now. So I'm going to use a mushroom on Mallow. Oh, I'll take it. I'll use Shocker on Mac. Wait for next turn for Mario. I've got a minute left. Hopefully I can get this done by then. Oh, you bring back the rock. I like this, but it's considerably less powerful. But I like the rock. Yeah, it's a very, very nice amount of challenge to the battle when he just randomly pulls it out and kills you with it. Speaking of killing, goodbye Mario. Wait, never mind. You stay alive. 24 seconds. For some odd reason, I don't think I'm going to be able to make this. Nope. 